What is up guys, Hooligan here, bringing another amazing Fortnite video, but before I get into this video, I'd like to ask a few things from you guys. The first thing I'd like to ask you is if you haven't already, please go subscribe to my channel. Every subscriber helps, and I really appreciate it. As well, if you are already subscribed to my channel, what I'd like you to do is turn on post notifications because if you turn on post notifications for my channel, it'll always give you an alert or a notification on your phone saying, hey, Hooligan Gaming posted this or is live streaming, and it'll alert you if I do anything with my channel, upload or live stream, etc. Lastly, if you want to go follow my Instagram, go in the comment section below because in the comment section, I will give you guys my Instagram name and you can go give me a follow. Hope everyone's having an amazing Sunday. I know it probably sucks because Monday school again unless you have some day off or something but here we are all right though let's get into it so for this amazing video what I'm doing is I'm showing the black knight off now I'm gonna get into how you got it and everything else so here's how you got it you had to play during season two and buy the battle pass in season two so you needed to do those two things and then you needed to get get the max tier which was tier 70 so that's another thing. Uh, the thing about season two is it's not like any of the other seasons. It was it was the first stone laid on the battle pass. Before the Black Knight, all we had was the season shop, which was sort of like a battle pass, but not well, it wasn't a battle pass at all. But it was sort of something like that, but it's different. Here's how it went: the item or the um the season shop. I'm sorry, I'm so used to saying item shop. The season shop. What that was is it would be like get to a certain level, so level 20, and then an outfit would be unlocked in the season shop, and you'd be able to purchase it, such as the Renegade Raider was level, I think, like 20 or 25, and like there was gliders and everything, but you had to not only rank up your account, like your level, but on top of once you got to that level, then you had to pay V-Bucks for the outfit, so that was all we had before this. Then season two comes out, they try a new way, they just have an item shop for skins you could buy, and then they have a battle pass. Well, the battle pass was obviously was a new thing, so they didn't know exactly how they were gonna go about it. So, and, that, and that's the thing. So it wasn't until season three that we got tier 100 instead of 70, okay? So yeah, they, so now we get more stuff, but back then this was the shit and it still is this is the best a battle pass I think yet <laughs> it'll never I don't think it'll ever be beaten but you're probably thinking to yourself here 70 why is that so special I mean that's lower than what we have to grind for now well the thing was back then okay there was no weekly challenges here here's what Fortnite did epic games every two days your daily challenges of reset so it wasn't even actually daily challenges Every two days, you would get one daily challenge. So that sucked. As far as weekly challenges go, you know how you get seven now? One for every day, or, or if you just grind it all out in a couple days. But regardless, you get seven to do each week. Back then, you got one challenge each week. One, like a singular, like one task to do, bam's complete, that's all you get. So between only getting one daily challenge, like, you know, every two days, and then only one challenge a week for the weekly challenges. I mean, you didn't have many, uh, you didn't have many op options really. If you went on a few days, you missed some daily challenges. I mean, regardless, it was so hard to get Black Knight, and that's why most people didn't. Okay, I'm not saying there's not a lot of Black Knights in the game because there is, but compared to the amount of people that play, those are all OGs, and there's not a whole lot of OGs compared to how many people's playing now. So yes, the Black Knight is very rare. Okay, this outfit is awesome though. It was a very big grind to get to tier 70 back then, believe it or not. Most people either had to play every day and grind a lot, or if they didn't do that, they had to buy some tiers. That, that's the only way. Because this outfit was not easy to get. You know, it's easier to get to tier 100 now than it was tier 70 back then. That, that's how it was. So if you weren't playing back then, you wouldn't know, but trust me, this is such a grind outfit. You got you had the grind to get it, and it is just an amazing outfit. Now, it's a legendary, which is cool. Back then, they weren't abusing the battle pass and stuff, making tier one skins legendary and stuff, okay? Um, so this outfit's a cool though, because it's a black outfit, and it has some featured uh, blood splatter on it, which is just awesome. So yeah, this outfit's really cool, okay? I'm into it, it just looks amazing itself. 
oh my god, someone joined and like screwed it all up. But yeah, so it's a black theme outfit, which the black ones look really nice, and then it just has like this blood on it, like, you know, like all the cute people you kill, you're, you're a black knight. You know, and it's pretty cool. He has the uh, good face mask. I think the blue squire over here would look really nice, but it would have to have the black knights. I mean, I guess that's why it's the blue squire, though, it doesn't have that full, uh, full uh, face shield or whatever. The black knight just with the red eyes and the, the whole shield that goes all over, it just looks amazing. It's got that cool scarf on there, and it got, you know what I mean? This outfit itself is just amazing. And then I'm about to show you the back bling real quick. Look at that. The uh, the Black Knight shield. Now, real quick, I want to show you. It is the only shield in the game that doesn't have a llama on it. Even the Red Knight. I don't have the Red Knight on this. But if I had the Red Knight, I could show you. The Red Knight is identical to the Blue Squire shield. Except, of course, it's just an all red shield. And it has a, a llama on it that's black. So it has black like a black print. But it has a llama on it that's black and it's pointing to the left. If anyone owns a red knight, you know what I'm talking about. The black bling has the, the animal on it pointing to the left. But the unique thing about the black knight is, it is the only back bling for the knights. It is the only shield that actually has a dragon on it. Every other one has a llama. I don't know why they did that. They're trying to say the black knight's superior to all the other knights. I don't know. But even the red knight, the girlfriend or whatever, the black knight, has a llama on her shield. And, it's, and everyone else's shield is pointing to the left. As you see, this royal shield and the squire shield are identical. All those shields are identical. But the black knight's the only one with a animal facing to the right and a dragon breathing fire. That's what makes this shield so amazing. The fact that it's a dragon breathing fire and all the llama standing on its legs. <laughs> That's how the red knight looks too, just different colors. The black knight's the only one with the pointing to the right and the fire. I don't know if they did that on purpose or just kind of like, hey, no one would care. I don't know. But I think that's cool because it's special to the Black Knight. Um, so yeah, I mean this outfit is just amazing. It's getting more, and it's I'm just glad I, I have it. And this is one of my favorite outfits in the game. I mean, look at it. it got the red eyes, the blood on it. You know, it has flavor. It's not just all black. I mean, it got the little red thing tied around. I mean, this outfit is cool, and it shows your OG. And in this back bling, it just looks amazing itself too. The back bling's awesome. He does have his own battle axe. Now this could go for any of the knights. This is kind of just like a universal battle axe. You could use it with Blue Squire, Royal Knight, Red Knight. But this is also from the battle pass. Of course, it was like a very low tier, I believe. So it was only like tiered like 23 or something. I, I don't know exactly, but it was, it was a lower tier than all the rest. This was maybe even lower, maybe like tier 10. I'm not sure. But it's still cool because it is a battle pass axe and it'll never come out again. But that's universal for all the knights. He does not have his own glider, sadly. But, I mean, who cares? Because I, I just used the aerial saw so one glider with him. So, I wouldn't probably I wouldn't use his glider much anyways. But, I mean, probably here and there. But let's, uh, let's go take this guy in the game here. So, let's go into a solo. And uh, I'm just going to show you. I'm probably going to die, but yeah. This, this skin really intimidates everyone else that's looking at it. I mean, this skin is amazing. And I know I've been rambling on about it, but it is such a skin. I wanted to give it the commentary that it deserves. This skin, like, this and, like, all the OG skins have meaning behind them. You know what I mean? You see someone with them, you're supposed to think they're good. You're supposed to be like, damn, it's an OG. And, um, a lot, I mean, obviously, a lot of people don't care. and <laughs> Some people care, but... That's what these skins have mean, you know, it's a black knight, you know, and it's the battle pass skins can never come back unless Epic went against everything they ever said. And then at that point, where's the game going, you know, um, but yeah, I mean, here it is all together, black shield, black knight that get a lot of attention with this uh, skin. Look, this guy's trying to robot, do a floss with him. I mean, this skin is just really cool, you know, um, do the flamingo. I mean, you can see. Look, it's got the red, got the red eyes. This skin's just awesome. I love it. The whole black theme, but with the red. This skin's cool. It's the best knight in the game. It has the coolest black bling out of all of them. I mean, a dragon breathing fire looks a lot cooler than a llama standing up on its hind legs. I'm not really sure why the other ones did that. Like I said, it kind of looks superior. Like the black knight, you're supposed to fear. It's a dragon breathing fire, not a llama. I don't really know what they're going for, though. But yeah, this skin looks amazing. And if you just think about when this skin came out, how different Fortnite was. I remember playing in like season two 
the game was nowhere near as it was now. The graphics were way more cartoony. The mini map looked like crap. I mean, now the mini map, look at that. Like, it looks rendered more. Like, it was just like the, the crappiest, like, graphics. And people dealt with that. And people got through that all because of, you know, what was going on. Now, you really want to land with me, dude. Oh, God. Oh, my God. What was that? How did I not kill him? Okay, that was a bad game. That's why I hate solo. It's always gonna be to a god. We're gonna try one more solo and then that's it. Cause I wanna be watching the Super Bowl right now. That's all I keep thinking about. Sorry guys. I um I hurried up, I was watching the Super Bowl and I'm like, you know what, I wanna do this video real quick. Cause I was gonna do it for a couple days now and then I just kept like doing other skins and like I was waiting and I was like, nah, I wanna do Black Knight. So here we are, <laughs> Black Knight. And yeah. But anyways, this skin just, that was from way back in the day. Way back in the day, this skin came out, and, and it's, it's just amazing to have it now. I do see a lot of people with it. Not a lot, but, you know, I run into Black Knight Shields occasionally, so, you know. It was one of those skins, though, that there weren't enough challenges to get the Tier 100 like there is now. Like, like now in the game, they have enough challenges, and if, if you play, you know, a lot, too, like... Like, you could easily get the Battle Pass to Tier 100 now. But back then, it wasn't like that at all. It was not like that back then. That guy's like, oh my god, I killed a Black Knight with my pickaxe. I don't know how to pickaxe too, buddy. I don't even know how he got me. I, I think I missed a shot or something. That's why pickaxes are so just... They're so unreliable. <laughs> you never know. If someone gets one lucky hit on you, you're dead. It's not even skill. It's just like, boom, boom, boom. Like, hitting each other. I'm not going to... uh uh, whatever, tilted this time. I'll consider retail. I don't even know. I'm probably gonna go salty because all the tryhards go to tilted. And I don't want to do that. But yeah, I mean, this skin is just awesome, and, and that's all it really is, you know. It's Black Knight. Such a cool, amazing skin. Like wow. Oh, why'd I do that? Oh my god, make it to the blue house. Make it to the blue house. But yeah, I mean, this Black Knight, or the back bling for the Black Knight goes good on multiple outfits. Goes good on a lot of outfits. If this guy comes to my house, I'm really gonna kill him. I gotta get that pump right now. I'm going in that gray house and killing everybody, by the way my plan before they all get super good guns let's do it yep it's time I don't have mats like that so let's hope for the best I'm probably about to get whooped oh my god there went every mat I just got oh my god I could just went up here I got 40 mats now because if I need to build a wall with a pump or something I'm gonna need to be able to you know and I want to get this guy was coming back up the stairs Oh hell no, you did not just do that to me. What the fuck? Dude, he's mad as hell. I hit him for a hundred. Oh my god, dude, quit. He's drinking. He's pissed. Oh my god! I get so mad when people gotta do cheap shit like that. I, I should've just ran after him right through the smoke and everything. He was low. He was so low. I hit him for a hundred. I hate that. I should've killed him. <laughs> he sucks. I'm getting, I just want to go watch the Super Bowl, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video on the Black Knight. I don't think I want to do any more games right now. Because for one, I hate solos. They're boring. I'd rather be with the whole squad. For two, I'm playing like crap right now. For three, the Super Bowl is on. So, yeah. I, um, I think I already said Super Bowl twice or three times. I don't even know. I just really want to watch that. I hope you guys enjoyed that. The Black Knight's an amazing outfit. If you have any questions about it, let me know. But, yeah, I mean, it's just crazy. Because back then, you know, you didn't have enough challenges to get your, all your tiers done and stuff so a lot of people had to buy up to the black knight if you didn't even play every day to get all every single challenge done that you possibly could you probably had to buy like almost half your tiers i mean i'm telling you a lot of people did 
they had to buy a whole bunch of tears because that's how hard it was. But that's just only because, you know, it's the beginning. This, this laid the first brick down on the battle passes. This was it. This is the OG battle pass. I mean, what we have today in season seven was all because of this guy right here. You know how well this battle pass sold. If the battle pass didn't sell good in season two, they probably weren't going to do it again. But they realized it was a good opportunity. And the, and the fact that battle pass skins can never come out, you never have to worry about this Black Knight. You know, just going to keep getting more rare and more rare. And um, yeah, so I mean, it's really cool though. I really like it. Tier, I mean, max tier shows a lot, you know, especially in season two. And um, it, it's just amazing. You know, it's a great outfit. Too bad I didn't have good gameplay for you guys to go with the outfit, but how it goes sometimes but this is it this is probably this is on my top three it's I, the gold trooper the uh, black knight and then probably sparkle specialist are my three top main skins that i wear the most and uh that that's really it though but yeah black knight is definitely if i had to pick between them i'd probably choose black knight over all mall to be honest i love black knight probably go black knight gold trooper sparkle specialist although if the gold trooper stays rare forever and it doesn't get added back that's my only reason i wouldn't pick ghoul i'd have to say it's a tie between black knight and ghoul but ghoul can get added back i believe so we'll see but with all that out the way i hope you enjoyed the video i hope you like the black knight <laughs> it is an amazing skin like i said i played pretty bad today but just how it is sometimes this be your boy signing out peace